do subscribe to ekeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hello students let us solve question number 32 of neat physics paper 2017 students let us solve the question number 32 the bulk modulus of uh, a spherical object is b this is a us modulus uh, anyway this uh, bulk modulus uh, is b for a spherical object if it is subjected to uniform pressure p subjected to pressure Uh, which is equal in uh, all re uh, all respects to the, each part of the sphere uniform pressure p so this p is uh, starting for the change in pressure that is applied uh, externally uh, the net pressure inside pressure and outside pressure so the difference is that uniform pressure p the fractional decrease in radius so because of the pressure the volume of this sphere will decrease so obviously and we are interested in finding out the decrease in radius the fractional decrease in radius suppose the initial radius is r this is the initial radius is r now the decreases to by amount Uh, delta r so the change divided by r is the quantity you have to find this is the fractional decrease in radius fractional decrease in the radius of the sphere we know that the bulk modulus is defined as this is a formula for bulk modulus it is defined as b equals to the change in pressure that you are applying divided by the volumetric strain that is the change in volume upon original volume so this change in volume of an original volume can be written as p over b bulk modulus now we are not interested in the fractional change in volume then the answer is p by uh, p by b we are interested in uh, finding delta r over r is how much then we must relate this v and r the volume of a sphere is given by 4 divided by 3 pi r q so if i write this one as a dv the change in volume If I differentiate that, then uh, with respect to R, say this is a uh, four by three pi three times uh, R square and uh, delta R. So if I divide this equation one and this equation two, if I divide equation two by one, what I will have? This uh, delta v over v left side, right side. This divided by that, four uh, by three pi into three r square delta r divided by four by three pi r cube. What will cancel? Four by three pi. One uh, r square is there and one r q is there, so r is left. So ultimately, I'm getting delta v by v equals to three delta r over r. So in place of uh, delta v by v, I'll write this here three times delta r over r. So if I do that, then three times delta r over r is uh, p over b. So this is p or v or delta r by r will be. This will come down. This is p divided by three v. This will be the answer.
if I see the options then uh, P by 3V is this one so the fourth one is the correct answer to this question okay thank you